Hello everybody, Bilbo Swaggins here, and we are hopping straight into Isaac. We are on save file 3 as normal, and we are going to win this one. We have the D6, and we uh, are going to win. That's all there is to it. Well, I think we're going to kill... Uh, we'll kill Isaac in this run. Ooh, Thunder Thighs is alright. The, the bonus of Thunder Thighs here is we get to just walk through rocks. This helps us, one, break tinted rocks, and two, helps us uh, just kind of clear the rooms. So there's less shenanigans going on. Oh, well, this is an example of not being able to get to the tinted rock. But hey, look at this. I don't have to use a bomb for this. Just an immediate tinted rock break. No bombs used. We can save our bombs for uh, secret rooms. It slows us down quite a bit, but it does make up for it in, you know, the uh, bomb-making department. We do like bombs around here. We get glowing hourglass and mom spurs, both which are, well, glowing hourglass can be good. Mom spurs is not as exciting. I thought it was an XL4 for a second, but no, it's just a really big first four. I was like, oh, we're going to get two item rooms and one four. But no. No, we are not. I guess you could tell because there's no double deal as well. I'm assuming the secret room is below us. But we will see. We will see. And these spiders are quite annoying. I hate the fat spiders. They're always a pain to deal with. Let's see. Take a room. You know what's unfortunate about this? Is because I'm going to take it. And it means that we have to drop the D6. Ah. Man. Dropping the D6 this early on after just unlocking it. Ironic. It's just... <laughs> <laughs> but the R key is better. It is better than <laughs> uh, Mr. D6 here. It's just, man. We spent all that time to get D6 and now we're not even going to use it? Don't worry. We'll use it in the future. But the R key here is going to be a lot more fun in the end. We're definitely going to win this one now. Like, we're definitely going to win this one now. <laughs> we have a lot of soul hearts as well. We're probably going to get... Um, that was worth it. Uh, we're probably going to get the devil deal here. The good thing about the devil deals is, is if we keep going through them. Well, we could also ignore the devil deal here and get a really high chance to uh, an angel deal. Later down the line. Sometimes it's worth it to go for the angel deals. You know, there's good items to be had in there. There's Sacred Heart. Um, there's the Crown of Light. I mean. Okay, a lot of the angel room items are maybe not that great. But the ones that are good are some of the best items in the game. I feel like that's the trade-off. You know what I mean? Like, you, you have garbage, uh, garbage gear. For the most part in there but when you do win you win big we're gonna check inside the shop just in case okay you know what it kind of worth because uh seven cents for the treasure map is actually kind of a good deal and we can break all these pots and these pots have a high chance to have a couple coins in them oh this is an annoying room Hopefully we don't get any more space bar items, but I think we could get like, um, uh, what's it called? Like, no. The trinket lets you stop getting space bar items in the pool. If we can get that, um, I think we're just, we're just winning. I mean, we're just winning. Let's see what we get. Hey, you know, that's pretty good. I thought it did that. It's a better in, uh, chance to win while gambling as well. Okay, well. Okay. 
We're not picking that up. <laughs> uh, this run is... Uh... <laughs> we're doing this, huh? <laughs> That's all I can say. We're, we're winning. We're definitely winning. This might be a longer run, though. Keep that in mind. Uh, this might be over an hour. Just for this one run. Oh, we don't have enough yet. Hold on. Bomb the keeper. He probably will drop one. And he doesn't. Okay. It's like it doesn't give us a penny for the rest of the four. It's like, no, no, no. No treasure map for you. One of these rocks will have a uh, trap door in it. I believe. Uh, surprisingly, I've not been hit yet. This is kind of a rough room to dodge tears in. <laughs> Oh, wow. Still haven't been hit. Okay, we're gaming. We're gaming. Oh, we're gaming. And okay, now we definitely have enough. Of the dime was overkill. The fun thing with the art key here is we're going to get some really fun stacks of, like, synergies. Because running through the floors twice is just going to pop off. We want to pop it as late as possible. So, we could actually do Shoal, and we could do Isaac in one run, if we get that far. So, we would pop this right after we kill Isaac, and then we would restart the whole run, and we would be able to go to Shoal afterwards. But we do have to go through the whole force process again, so we have to go straight up from the beginning to the end. But there will be items on the force, so, I mean, we're going to be broken by the end of it. Like... In situations like this, you're just winning. <laughs> we have the treasure map as well, so this is going to speed us up a little bit too. So if we can get in like boss rush and we're strong enough to do it, I mean, we're kind of just set, right? Like, aha, I thought so. I could kind of tell. I don't know where the secret room is, which is funny because like... I figured out where the super secret room is, which should be in harder in theory. It's just that room, I think it typically has the super secret room in it. Uh, hopefully we get the double deal here, but we're a little low on uh, the old uh, soul hearts. So I went in this big room because I, I hate, I hate getting double deals, you know? Oh, this is scary. Good thing we can run through the floor. Hey, pushpin's actually pretty good. Don't underestimate pushpin. That gives you piercing tears occasionally, right? Which is pretty good. And I think it is luck dependent. I'll have to check when I actually get to the item. Come here, sir. Okay. Uh, yes. So, that's pretty good for us. Check the pots. There's no reason not to check the pots. Swallowed Penny is huge. I, I'm sorry, Pushpin, but Swallowed Penny is going <laughs> to net us more here in the end. Oh, no, we took damage. Well, if we use bombs wisely here, we should be fine. Oh, this is a bad boss for us to be dealing with, but hold on. I, I just uh, annihilated him. I was going to be honest, though, if there was Brimstone in there, I was immediately taking it because, well, there's so many synergies with Brimstone, it wouldn't even be worth taking the Angel Deals. Sulfur, you know, gives you Brimstone, but that's not what we're looking for because we would have to drop the R key and that obviously defeats the whole purpose. Normally, I would take Sulfur. It's a good item. Uh-oh, we're definitely taking damage in this room. This room's the uh, split enemy tier room. As I like to think of it. These are all enemies that just have like split tears at you. Oh, you almost hit me. Man, we're getting kind of lucky. I'm going to be honest. Like we're getting kind of really lucky in this run. Range up. I mean, all the all the pills are going to be positive now, by the way. Because we got luck foot. Lucky foot. Not luck foot. Oh, no. We took damage. Well, you know, it was a good run of not taking damage while it lasted. I'm not too worried about it. We already got the uh, double deal last four, which was kind of the more important one to get. Because this four is a pretty low chance as is. This room is tough to deal with, honestly, with the low speed. 
It's kind of hard to dodge those tears. Oh, yeah, we have a map. I, I wasn't even looking at the map yet. Uh, there might be a room down here. What is that pill? Can't tell. That's okay. Uh, we do have a blood machine here, which could pay out for us if we get some health ups. Or if we just get full health pills. We don't know what that pill is. Holding tab kind of shows it. It appears. Or it's just because it's still too far away, so it won't tell me anyways. We're getting hit a lot. But whatever. As long as we're alive, I don't care. We're the item room here. Oh boy. Oh boy. I knew they were going to do that the second they came into frame. When they're bunched up like that, they tend to make like this long jump. Little... <laughs> Sorry. Um, little Gertie's... Uh, not really what we're looking for, but at least it does something. Although there's something it does isn't really great. It doesn't have good damage, really. As you can see, it's confined by the room. Uh, one of these directions is the boss room, and one of these is the uh, shop. Which one is which? There's the boss room. Get rid of this guy. He can fire explosives. He's a little bit more threatening. Uh... I'm going to hit spacebar accidentally. You know it's going to make me really sad. I'm keeping my finger away from it. But you know, like when I'm hitting like the loading screen, I, I spam space because I want to get to the loading screen faster. It's like when you're hitting the button in the elevator and you keep hitting it. You're like, come on. It's like that. Uh, booster pack isn't really worth taking. I mean, it's just not great. Okay, the spiders are out of hand. Give me money. I already have 30 cents, but I want more money. Uh, is this the secret room? No. Okay. That's fine. This is actually... Little Gertie's good for this boss. Kind of a little bit of a shame there's rocks in this room, but it's what, it is what it is. We'll clear out some of them. Okay, he gets caught in there. A little... <laughs> unlucky. If we were speed running, this would be bad RNG. Man, I don't want this. We're not looking for range up upgrades. We're looking for more. Uh, we'll head left real quick and see if there is anything down here. Well, definitely worth checking here. You can make the pathways with the uh, Stompy transformation, as you can see. And we'll get the coins as we're coming back, because we needed to see what was over here. I mean, maybe we should check every room, but uh, we are kind of slow. And I do want to make a uh, boss rush, if possible. Because more items is better. The boss room is definitely on the bottom. The shop might be on the top right there. It might be one of those instances. This is why you take treasure map. Experimental pill. Could, be, could pay out. Also kind of risky. Got speed up. We like pure upgrades. Range. The range is going crazy. I'll give it that. He's not dead. What? Bro didn't want to die. I, I understand. But like. I got a boss rush to get to. The poops are everywhere. Where's my petrified poop? This is supposed to be a lucky run. If it was really lucky, I would have petrified poop. And I know I obsess over it, but I'm telling you, it's it's a go to drink it. Although I do think you know that. It's just like, you're, I'm probably hyping it up too much for you. Swallowed Penny's paying out, like, really often. I told you the shop would be up here. I wanted to check the shop anyways at the cost of time because of, uh... Okay, two nickels. <laughs> but, at, uh, because, uh, da, 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 da. we have a lot of money. We have a lot of money. Two clubs, it's worth it, I guess. And the jumper cables is whatever. I mean, right now it's not doing anything for us, but in the future it might. I'm going to be honest. I don't think we're making boss rush, which is really sad. It is what it is.
Okay, we need double keys here. Here's up. I mean, we're just getting raw upgrades. I mean, this is huge. Okay, little Gertie is actually kind of popping off. I'm going to be honest. I was smack talking him, but he's doing a lot of work right now, and I appreciate it. Okay, lead pencil's pretty good. Kelly pills? That, well, we're definitely not making it now. <laughs> Game's like, ah, you wanted to get to the uh, boss room, huh? How about no? Uh, nope. I was wondering if the secret room was there, but it is not, clearly. As you can see, Lead Pencil occasionally makes you fire out a burst of tears. I, I don't remember what the rules are, like what the luck is or whatever it is. But it does that. It's a cluster tier every 15 tiers. Okay, that's what it is. This is the secret room. It has to be. I, I didn't need more money. We need one more key, by the way, for that treasure room. Could be worth checking out. Sometimes they do have items in it. It's a little rare. Oh. Okay, if money equals power is in the devil room, I'm sorry, but I'm taking it. The money's going nuts. Swallowed Penny is paying out every two seconds, I swear. Now, that also means I'm getting hit a lot, but we do have a lot of HP right now, given the uh, four we're on. And we do have a little bit of, like, uh, regeneration capability. You know, we got the uh, old bandage there, which is going to pop us a, a heart every now and again when we take hits. The Stompy was huge. I think Stompy is actually kind of winning us the run, even though it's making us take a little bit more damage in return. Oh, that's not the super secret room? Maybe it's here. It's typically not connected to two rooms. Yeah, no. I don't think it's ever connected to two rooms, right? The double hit from Gertie? Our dodging is, like, insane right now. Sir, please die. Sir, please die. Okay. This should be a double room item. Ugh. The tears up. I mean, I can't complain that much, right? We do have keys. Let's go up to the treasure room. We're going to take this slow. Because we're taking, one, a lot of damage. And two, we're not making boss rush anyways. And we could do hush in theory. I actually don't remember. <sighs> Hold on. Well, the timer does not reset, so I'm assuming you can't do hush. Okay, that paid out. Uh, yeah, but I'm assuming you can't do hush because the timer doesn't reset, so obviously there's no way to get to it. But there, I think there are ways to get the hush without using the traditional route. Whatever, open it. <laughs> but I can't remember what. I'm, it's like, it's been a while. I used to min-max this game a lot. Like, I would play the dailies every day, getting, like, top 200. But... My time has passed. It's been a while. Last time I played this game was Repentance and this playthrough, obviously. And I did not play it in-depthly through Repentance. I just beat it on a couple characters. You know, beat the final boss, beat Mother. But when it comes to base Isaac mechanics, I am uh, well aware. Our tier rate's actually kind of crazy. I'm going to be honest. With our damage as well, I mean, that's that's good damage. And lead pencil's going to be shooting out every, like, two seconds. Now that I think of it, lead pencil and number one, or uh, soy milk even. Good combo. You get the damage up. I mean, you can get damage up with soy milk. It just takes a while because of the damage multiplier. You get that up. I mean, you're you're popping off. It must know that I'm uh, strong against this boss right now with uh, the Gertie. See? That's why. It's a good item against him. 
Oh boy. We didn't take a hit, man. Even though we're low speed, we're kind of doing good on the dodging. Our money's crazy. The game won't stop giving me money. Uh-oh. I'm going to get hit here. There's no way, right? We're insane. We are insane. I'm going to have to stop picking up money here soon. We're getting too much money. We're going to hit the cap. We're just deep pockets when you need it. There you go. Uh, the shop's probably on the right here. Yep. There is rules to the generation. Typically stuff like that, you know. Not used to like vocalizing it, but a lot of times you, know, you play the run, you're like, uh, you know, it's probably right there. So I try to vocalize it, you know, vocalize it so you guys can tell as well, in case you don't know. But there's rules and generation rules all to the, like, how things spawn. Okay, well, Loki's horns are pretty good, actually. I mean, there's nothing wrong with that. Bigger room? Nope. We did grab the compass there, by the way, because, I mean, we got the map, we got the compass. Now we know everything besides the secret rooms, but the secret rooms were already kind of decent at. I don't always check, mostly because of laziness, because a lot of times the secret room doesn't actually have anything in it. And we're not working, we're not really looking to min-max the run right now. We're looking to win the run. Min-maxing the run would win you the run, but we want to make things like hush and boss rush. You gotta be a little bit faster. I almost hit spacebar, by the way, to re-roll that. I would have felt like an idiot. But we're fine. We didn't do that. Which is the important part. Super secret rooms that found the right here. If it's not... I don't know. I don't know what to say because I don't know where else it would have spawned. It could have spawned on the bottom right there, but that'd just be annoying. And it spawned on the bottom right. <laughs> Ow! Really a nickel? What is going on with the money? I don't understand. I really don't. Gertie's just messing him up, man. He wasn't ready for that. Okay. We get the double deal at 18% chance. Is that what that was? Alright, Guppy's collar is not worth. Because we could get angel deals still. Right? We didn't take a double deal. No, we did not. Yeah, we could actually still get angel deals, which is kind of important. Because there's good items to be had in there. I don't like this room. I hate turrets. They're so annoying because I'm not looking at them constantly. You just kind of have to go based off like timing. Gotta know when you're in their range. Okay, not the secret room. Maybe the game will give me, you know, blue map. And then I'll have the full set. I don't know if that gets you an item or not. I feel like it probably does though. That's kind of like a thematic set. Larry Jr. You're a, little be weak. You're a little weak to be fighting me. Oh boy. Run away! I should check the curse room still. Hold on, we're gonna go in the curse room. It'd be funny if there was like something insane in there like, you know, go ahead. Like, ah, oh, yes, we took one curse room and it happens to be like the best one. Yeah. A lot of enemies it's giving me that are like really convenient for Gertie. 
I, I was shit talking him, and so the game was like, nah, nah, see, look, you gotta look at his situational use cases. He really isn't that good normally, because you're not gonna get him charged up fast enough. He doesn't do that much damage on the weak charges. Like, this, uh, these guys, I don't think he's popping off. You got a hit there, which is nice. Extra damage is extra damage. And see, so miss there. He's just not good in this use case. Oh. But he's good on multi segmented enemies, like, you know, Larry. Oh, I didn't get hit. Nice. No, the pretty fly blocked it. Okay, this is an insane item. I don't know what the game's doing. Like, is like Edmund himself coming out and apologizing? He's monitoring this run. He's like, nah, nah, change that item to this. This is a really good item to get, though, because when you kill an enemy, it uh, turns it into like a follower and they just kind of sit there. So you get a, a, you know, an enemy or a boss that spawns a lot of like minions. This thing pops off because you're going to have all of those guys out there doing damage. Buddy in a box. It's worth it, I guess. Are we on the crop list? We are. So what we should do is probably deposit as much money as possible. I looked away for a second because I thought I was running into it. And I thought it broke immediately because I didn't hear the coins. Okay, we still have 35 cents to spare. I'm kind of relieved in a way because I was going to deposit it all. But I was like, if it breaks, that's cool because we still have money for this run. Oh, pins. Oh, no. Oh, it's this room. This is a little bit more uncommon of a room. <laughs> he ran into the fire. Yeah, mess him up. Yeah, boss like this is good too because he'll spawn the maggots, right? And then that'll give you more, you know, damage basically in the end. It's actually going to be on the left here. I don't know why I did bottom. Like I said, it does not appear on the bottom. Well, it doesn't connect to like two rooms at once typically. I think it never does. But don't quote me on that. Okay, Ivy Bag's alright. We get most of our money back. And we get a judgment here that will get us more health probably. But he's definitely going to get us more health. I don't think he can drop anything else besides food items now. His lucky foot is the other thing he would have dropped. No, he can drop bum friend, I believe, right? Pretty sure. I'm pretty sure. We did not make boss rush. Uh, definitely did not. I hate this version of this boss. I'm going to be honest. Mostly because we don't have speed right now. And that's uh, not good for us. We just have to keep moving in a circle here. It's just, it, it's what we got to do. Stay in our little box here. When she comes down, we can hold still for a second and obviously blast her. But we got to stay in this very small little box. But our damage is good. We got decent damage for the tier rating. Huge. Okay, the mother transformation is almost complete. I don't like that I keep getting range upgrades, but it is what it is. Okay, we're moving on to the next floor. We're going to pop the Ansys room just to see where the secret room is for sure. Bosh is also a good, like, uh, boss for this, uh, you know, Quinn uh, item to appear in. Because... He spawns all those minions, and obviously, they turn into uh, the things, I believe. Now, smaller guys, like you just saw those spider lits, I don't. But I'm pretty sure the hush, like, zombie minions do. I'm gonna be honest, I just said the spiders don't, but then it, it just happened. For some reason. I don't think that was supposed to happen. It's not on there anymore. So I was going to see like what it exactly said in the description, but I can't even check. So it doesn't matter. 
Well, this is scary. I'm probably going to take damage. We didn't. We're such a gamer right now. What's going on? The low speed's making me play properly. We're going to keep Swallow Penny because Swallow Penny's getting us money. And we're going to, you know, hit the R key. This co-op baby is actually kind of good. It's a co-op baby doing that, right? Spawning the little horn shots. That's kind of powerful. Oh, it's greed. Can you give me a steam sale? Like, that would be really cool, man. That would be super cool. He didn't. Well, that's because greed isn't super cool. Unlike me. Uh, well, that's my own fault. I was dodging these guys. I did not even see the brimstone wall crawler things going on in the room. We're going to go back and grab that health. Because our health is getting a little little on the sketch side. I'd rather not die. Though in the worst case scenario, I will just hit the space bar button. If we drop it to like half a heart. Hopefully the game gives us something good soon. Like, I don't know. Something. <laughs> something defensive. Infamy would be cool. The wafer would be cool. You don't see that often anymore. I feel like in Classic Rebirth, you saw that a lot. You don't see it often anymore. It's a rare item. Because it's, it's a really fucking good item, though. Like, you get a wafer and you're, you're taking half damage across the whole run. I like that, but I'm not going to do it. I could have gone to the curse room, but I'm going to be honest... We're not here to min-max. We're here to get busted. Min-maxing does that. But it's slow. Ow. Okay. You gotta die, man. I don't like you for doing that. I, no, I would have hit the spacebar button if that health didn't spawn. Woo. Getting a, getting a little sketchy, I'm going to be honest. But we're fine now. Please let me kill Isaac and then let me kill Satan in one run. Health, 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 health. What is that pill? Telepills. Small chance to teleport Isaac to the air room? I didn't know the telepills. Could, ah, never mind, I, I knew that. Don't listen to me. It's like you should have taken the chisel. Look at these spikes you could have gotten into here for free. I want to pop it. Okay. I was like, you know what? We're going to gamble and see if we get in the IM air room. We did not. I'm going to skip this room. I'm going to be honest. This room uh, looks annoying. And we know where the boss is. Huge. Uh, okay. We're just throwing a bomb in there. So maybe it'll be a bit easier. Uh, okay. We'll, we'll be fine if we go through the center. <laughs> there we go. Man. It did not want to make that easy. Let's see if we can get some health from this. Nope. No health. Ah. Uh, please don't kill me. You wouldn't kill me right now, but don't anyways. I think the secret room is right here, by the way. No, it's definitely not. Never mind. There's a pit. There's a pit on any side of where you think the secret room is. It's not the secret room. It's got to be accessible from all sides that it's available from. But there's a room and it's connected to the room. It's got to have a side, you know, that connects to it. Otherwise, what you're looking at is not the secret room. I hate this champion because he just, he's, he's a sponge. And this guy is teleporting everywhere every two seconds. There we go. Super secret room is up here. It's not? Okay. Well, whatever. Ah. Uh. 
Just blast her. This is an easy win from this point on. Honestly, the babies up there will probably just kill any, like, laser dudes that spawn. Oh, she's doing the freaking beam attack. This is the worst attack she can do. In my opinion. Because it, it'll actually probably hit you. Like you just saw. But her normal attacks like this, pretty easy to dodge. You might get hit by them. Don't worry too much about it if you do. Okay, uh, we do have a double deal. It's not good. So we ignore it. But it is kind of worth taking it. <laughs> you know, I was on the fence about it, but I'm like, nah, it's kind of worth though. As once we get into that second run, we're going to be cooking with that. Okay. So we probably just want to head straight to the boss. I'm going to be honest. We don't want to dilly dally. No dilly dallying here. Do your room? Ah, I should have waited. Wow, that wasn't even worth. We'll skip one room, though. Ooh. We'll save it for now. Because that's going to give us a full heart. And we're only on a half heart. There's no real reason to grab it yet. Oh, no. Not the pot dudes. I hate these dudes. They, they're pretty likely to hit you when they throw a pot. Luckily, this guy's kind of getting bounced around by our tears. Okay. Uh, uh, how am I not hit yet? Well, I did finally get hit. Okay, lucky. Oh, we're doing this, huh? Hmm. Oh, oh, no. Don't do that. Don't do that. Don't do that. Man, what the hell? It's my own fault, but my brain started to fry once they started hitting me. Well, we should probably look for health then. I right, okay. Well, we got a health back. Man, I'm getting hit a lot. We might have to hit the spacebar button. Isaac's a little zany when he starts firing pretty fast. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness, man. Can you stop? Stop. Okay, got me some health back. It's going to cost me a full heart to go into the donation machine there, so it's not worth. Oh no, not this guy. Secret room? Really? Here? Oh, what? Okay. Okay. That was just kind of rude of the game. I'm going to be honest. It's unfortunate, but we might have to hit the space bar here. This is such a dumb room to have right before the boss. Okay. Let's see if we can no-hit Isaac. We probably won't. If I had Sci-Fly, 100%, I'm no-hitting him. Okay, we're getting hit a lot. Right off the bat. Right off the bat. Oh, man. We got hit a lot right off the bat. That's so unlucky. We're, ooh, one more hit. One more hit. Okay, we're out. We're out. We're out. We're out. <laughs> I know it's sad, but man. The potential. Wait, can we donate the machine again? Ooh. Hey, that's kind of worth, though. Got some coins in there. Well, I'm going to tell you, when we come to rematch Isaac, we're beating his ass. Only we had more HP. That's what we were really missing in that run.
It would have helped if I dodged better as well. But he kind of annihilated me right at the start there. The stars card and high priestess. We'll keep the stars card. Keeps us, uh, saves us a key. We might find, you know, a big chest room or something. Or angel chests. And it might be worth it to have all these keys on hand. But as you can see, we keep all our items. And we are right at the beginning again. And we will keep getting items. By the time we fight Isaac again, he is not going to handle us even for a second. There is one more key in there. I missed it. I mean, not a key. Pill. Infested. Infested. This looks like the secret room, by the way. <laughs> and this actual, like, secret room, not the super secret room, is right here. Typically, it's going to be surrounded on three sides. Sometimes there's multiple options for that. And it can be biased towards an item room. Or it could just be, you know, it's a coin flip. There might be some way to tell. I don't know how to tell, though. Poor Larry Jr. He didn't deserve that, man. He did not deserve that. As you see, we're uh, getting into the crazy territory already. Just immediately. Like I said, this is going to be a long run. Like, uh, we're already at 40 minutes. Now we can kind of slow down and just kind of check whatever we want. We don't have to min-max or anything, but we're here to, you know, maybe check some curse rooms or check out the, uh, sacrifice room. They're not even having a chance, man. It's so sad we got hit so often right there at the start of that Isaac fight. We should have been able to beat him, but it was unlucky. And skill issue. Damn. I was hoping it would teleport me to the IM air room. It just would have been fun. Not really tactically smart. Why are you giving me the quarter, man? Come on. I don't need that. I don't need that. Something's wrong. Name a more useless bill. Where is the freaking small rock? I feel like I've broken, broken like over a hundred of these things. This is ridiculous, man. I will say our, uh, our theory rate's kind of crazy. Contract from below is kind of just paying out like I'm insanely. Balls of steel? I mean, okay. Okay, this is, uh, <laughs> this is actually kind of good. Wait, what was this one? Oh, something's wrong. Yeah, I don't care about that. Uh, I think the secret room was up there. Whatever. I think the super secret room's here on the bottom right. Although, these big rooms can kind of be like a mix-up. Sometimes they're on the top right. Sometimes they're on the bottom right. It's weird. I think this one will be right here. It's not. Here. It's not. <laughs> well, I tried. Dude, we got our health back. We're using the razor. Uh, well. Most of these are good, but the fire rate's gonna go crazy with the 1.5 times. I mean, those are good, but no. I wonder if it reset our devil room chance. Probably doesn't. Like, you know what I mean? Like, uh, we probably can't get the angel room anymore. Still. But we'll see. We'll see. The percentage is there, but is it always there? Even when you can't get any more? Oh, no. Oh, no. I'm sorry, guys. But when it happens, I gotta reroll. Was it worth it? We got brims. <laughs> We got brimstone and money equals power. Oh, what the fuck? 
Well, that's a rare uh, re-roll win. Now, if I had this versus Isaac, he was getting his ass kicked. Because this uh, little fly you see around me, I think his name is... Uh, oh, what's it called? Is it BBW? No, no, it's not. No, it's not. Um, is it BBF? I don't know. But anyways, he's really good at blocking tiers. Like, he's a top tiers defensive item. We get OEG board again. Reason why is I, I do think the uh, the item pools reset when you uh, do a Arky. So we could technically have duped items there. But it's fine. It's unlikely anyways. Arky is like an S tier item just because it creates a lot of funny. And okay. Man, it's so sad. We need to get wild. Yeah, the wild card. Where do we get wild card from? We have restonk. Oh no, man. Oh no. What is the game doing? Steam sales on sale. Okay, we stop. One, we're out of money. And two, it's getting too crazy. <laughs> what is this run? Uh, we did lose a lot of the benefits of our, I think, uh, our last build there. So I think without Lucky Foot, our pills will go back to being negative. Or maybe. I don't know. Listen, it gets weird. When you reroll, shit gets weird, okay? Stuff wasn't designed for this. Our speed is nuts. Our damage is decent. We have Brimstone. And we have money equals power. We have a lot of crazy stuff. We even have Punching Bag. Punching Bag is an S tier item as well, in my opinion. Defensively. As an overall item, I mean, it's, it is what it is. I give it an A tier. Yep. That's what we're doing right now. That is what we're doing right now. I think double using uh, the book, by the way, this book, uh, gets you an item. Uh, I feel like it does. I can't remember. It's like getting two of like hypno tears or homing tears like this get to something. But we have a bent spoon unlocked, right? So it can't be bent spoon. Okay, we're immune to explosives now. I guess we'll see in this room. Ah, we did Bobby Bender. Look, it was Ben Spoon. Wait a minute. Why did we get Ben Spoon in that one run? Was it because it was a challenge run? The challenge runs do have all the items. Or maybe they have most of them. I don't know. Because I also found the Mega Blast in that one run, right? I didn't take it because, well, <laughs> that's just silly. <laughs> that is just silly. Or was it the uh, big bomb one? You know, it drops a huge bomb. Either way, those are both unlock items anyways. Point being is, I should not have had them. Well, we do have the bent spoon now in the pool. Which, it's a good item. It's homing tears. Yeah, this build is uh, just winning. Actually, really, the damage could be better. I know that's kind of, you know... It's like, really? But like... We only have six damage. When, you know, you get this deep in, you figure you have a little bit more damage, I'm going to be honest. Our fire rate is maxed. We get a stars card. Stars card. Stars card. And a magician card. Three stars cards? Really? Oh, well, we'll use one immediately here. May as well. Check inside here. Do it. Why not? Yeah, the run's getting a little crazy, you know what I mean? We did lose contract from Blue as well, which is kind of sad. Get out of here. Alright. Now we use the stars card. Infestation 2 is actually huge. But basically, when you hit an enemy with Infestation 2, um... Spawns flies and spiders, I think. No, just just spiders. There's a infestation one, which it gives you them on kill, I think, right? Infestation one's on kill. 
Which is good as well, but not as good as just hitting them and getting the spiders. Okay, that room's nothing. Iwaz, huge trap door. We just take it to the shop. x uh we take the double card, why not? Not like it really particularly matters, we're kind of OP. Okay. Yeah, well, the money's going a little crazy. <laughs> I don't know what's up with this run and the money, but... Oh, we got to switch our items. Yeah, it's because uh, the bottom right items, you know, the usables are the same bind as the uh, active items. You got to be a little careful because we don't want to use dupe yet. We don't want to use the dupe yet. There's a lot of funny things we could do with the dupe. The world, the world is a vampire. Fighting greed again. We do have Samson Shame, by the way, so we can still kind of break rocks like we did when we had Stompy. Uh, yeah, this run's just, uh, it's one of those runs, you know? You were just winning from the get-go. Nothing really good in there, though. A little sad. Super secret room up here, maybe? Nope. So it's probably next to the boss, probably. Uh, I would like to have both, but we can't get both. But you can see why Infestation 2 is good. I mean, you hit these enemies and they just turn into flies. I mean, yeah, whatever. Oh, I didn't use the EWAS. And we can just use it on the next floor. It doesn't matter. <laughs> it's like, it doesn't really matter. Sir, I'm going to have to ask you not to do that. Thank you. Okay. It's just, it's it's not necessary. Yeah, we can get angel items. So we just take the halo. I mean, it's not even a question. The flight would be cool, but uh, halo is better in every way. Okay. <laughs> this run is just, you know, cracked, as they would say. Uh, 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 two of hearts. I mean, that's cool. Yep, the damage is looking a lot better now. <laughs> yeah, in case you didn't have enough keys, here's a golden key for this four. I, I don't know. I don't know, guys. It, this run just, it, it's one of those kind of runs. It's not busted, but the game keeps giving me the right items. Even when I rerolled, it still just kept feeding me. At this point, I'm like obese. I'm fat. I, I, I do so many items you're giving me that I, I just... Why? This is unhealthy. For the enemies. Not me. This is healthy for me. I enjoy this a lot. Super greed, come on, you're taking up my shop spawns. Get out of here. The quarter again. What the hell, man? Bro, <laughs> what the fuck? What is going on? Uh use the Ewaz rune in here. Don't be dumb. Oh, it just went to the next floor. I thought if you used it on wood fords, it would always do it. Maybe I got lucky in that one time when I tested if it worked on wood fours. And it was actually on top of a gem. Man, what the hell? The spiders, <laughs> spiders, man. Look at the spiders. What is going on?
We still have a dupe, by the way. <laughs> like, this run isn't quite over yet in terms of the luck. If we dupe the right item, it's going to get really funny. Come on, give me something cool. No, that's not, that's not cool at all. Uh, we don't want that. Uh, sure. Probably get us more HP in the end. Do we still have old bandage? We do. We have it by chance. It just re-rolled into another old bandage. Just entirely luck. You may ask, why am I doing this when I don't need this much money? It's because I want blood bag. Which I finally got. We get a sun card. The sun. Okay, that's where it is. Okay, we wanna we wanna get out of this room. We wanna put our keys into this guy too. I think he can drop the cool stuff, right? Come on. Come on. Not just giving you this shit for free. Okay, I'm obsessed fan, whatever. Technically, I think the D6 can drop as well. So we could get the D6 back, which would be very funny. Okay, we the money. I, I don't I don't need the money. Please stop. It's not about the money, okay? Um Judas's tongue. I mean, that could be insane as well. We we have money. We don't we don't need swallow penny. So all Penny is just unnecessary. It's just a flex at this point. What the fuck? Are you kidding me? What the hell is going on? Why was that just in here? I don't understand why that was just in there. It's a good item. Like, it's not breaking the run, but like, it's a good item. Multi-dimensional baby is breaking the run. Because multi-dimensional baby with brimstone is actually cracked as hell. I don't know if you've ever gotten brimstone through it, but like it does insane damage because it just stacks the brimstone on top of each other. Yep, that's me. Mm hmm. Yeah, more fire rate multiplier. <laughs> what the hell, man? What is going on? Uh, yeah, we're just gonna go down. I mean, what else am I supposed to say? This run's insane? I think you know that already. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Sure, why not? Just, why not? I mean, there's no reason not to. Bro thought he was going to touch me. Okay. Mm hmm. Because what we need is more money. If it's not a luck up penny, I don't care about it. Another moon card? Why not? You know. He doesn't even know what's attacking him yet. Like, he's just like, I just spawned in. What, what's going on? I'm getting spawn killed. Okay. Well, I... I just find it really funny that this all stemmed from me, like, wanting to use D6. And, uh... I end up not getting to use D6, and it just turns into an insane run. No. Not again. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> Look at the damage. What? Bro, what? We got sci-fi as well? What? 
And we do have Lucky Foot again. We have Sacred Heart. What? Why are the why why are the cards glowing? I don't know why the cards are glowing. Well, the damage is so insane. It it does not matter. It it doesn't it doesn't matter. Was there a boss? Sorry, I, I didn't see anything. I, I I don't know what's going on, guys. I'm going to be honest. I don't. Why am I doing this? It doesn't matter. It literally doesn't matter. <laughs> going on i don't understand I, I i don't i don't know what's going on guys this is this is weird to me too isaac runs typically aren't this good they're just dying when i enter the room what's going on what's wrong with that oh it's because we have pay to win the pay you know so basically, there's an item here that lets you use coins on things instead. I was like, oh, the lock on that looks really weird. I think that's what that was, right? Does it look like a coin slot? Or I'm insane. Like, I mean, the run's crazy. I could just be crazy at this point. I don't know. Like, I enter the room, the enemies die. It's... I don't know. Like, I enter the room. I'm not even hitting them with the tears yet. They're just dead. We haven't gotten planetariums yet. I'm assuming we need to unlock them. It's funny because even if there was any vulnerabilities in this build, Sci-Fi is here to make sure there is none. The caves are flooded. Oh my gosh, we got... Whoa, we unlocked another floor. Let's go. Okay, well, we're going to go kill Isaac, I guess. <laughs> I, I, I guess... I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Whatever monsters were in here. Sloth is honestly surviving longer than the one boss was. Whatever it was. I think it was... Was it Fistula? I think it was Fistula. Oh, we have all the flies are friendly as well. Just in case, you know, we, we, we really needed that. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. The only thing that'll hit me, freaking uh, turrets, and that's simply just because they can't insta die. We have dead eye as well, seemingly. So like, when we do make contact, we immediately just start doing insane damage. Okay, well, pop that. Whatever. We're gonna clear the whole floor because it's it's over after we're done here. Okay. What's that even going to do at this point? There's a freaking... I was like, if that is a black market, I, I don't know what to say. Whatever, we'll take it. It did not actually make our tears go up. I, I, I didn't check if it was a multiplier. So actually all we did was lower our damage a little bit, but I don't think it matters. Because like I said, when we make contact with an enemy, Deadeye activates. And when that activates, we do... I, it's, I think it's a damage multiplier up of our damage. And it stacks a couple times. So, like... There is no survival for any enemy. Any enemy that decides to take more than one hit... Dies. Okay? Because what we needed was more. More damage. I don't know what just made us do, like, 40 damage there after taking hit. What was that? I feel like it's off the tip of my tongue what that did, what that was, but I don't remember what it was. Unless I accidentally popped the strength card. Yep. I used a penny and guess what? It's like, hey, here's a dime. That, that's that been the run. Okay. Yeah, because what I wanted was more luck. I mean, I'll take it. It's another dime. 
Okay, HP up. Um, yeah. I don't know what to say, guys. This was a fun run, though. <laughs> this was crazy. <laughs> this was so crazy. What is it? A new pill. Let's go. The one that makes you cough up the last pill you use. It's actually pretty good. I think it's called Horf, right? It's like Horf. Oh, there's something in here. Uh, it's the pot dudes. Huh? I had to make sure I cleared this room. You know, it's important. Mm-hmm. Oh, we've never seen those enemies before. They died really fast, though. They must have been, like, you know, nothing. Not like a boss or anything like that. A boss wouldn't be that weak. Nope, I think that's it. I, I would go look for the, you know, the, uh... The, uh... The super secret room, but, uh, I don't... It's, it's not gonna net us anything. Well, that was that. Uh, wow, that was a crazy run. Hour and six minutes. Yep. Isaac Deer. It, it used to be a better item. It's, I think it's a little nerfed now. But hey, we're filling out the picture. Look at that. I think uh, two more wins. Is that right? Two more wins against Isaac and we had the Polaroid. And then we just need to finish up the negative. We would have had two there on our one, but eh, you know, it is what it is. We uh, weren't able to beat Isaac the first go around, but we beat him the second time. But hey, anyways, that's all for today, guys. I hope you enjoyed that one. That one was a fun one. Hopefully we can get that on like Maggie here because Maggie's fucking hard. She has such a slow start. But yeah, the rest of these guys, I mean, they're all easy in their own ways. Some of them are difficult, like Blue Baby. But we already got some of his stuff done. And Kane is easy. Judas is easy. Uh, we don't we don't talk about Jacob and Asa. We don't talk about them. When we get to them, bear with me. <laughs> it's going to be bad. But hey, anyways, hope you guys enjoyed. See you on the next one. Peace.